last two days, <clears throat> for the last two days, I've been passing out without turning out my lights. So usually I make my lights very vibey. You guys know that. You guys have seen that a couple times. I like turn down the lights. So I have like a main bedroom lighting and then I have like a side bedside lamp. And my bedside lamp is a, um, the light bulb changes colors. Like, I can change it on my phone. It's, like, Bluetooth. It's really cool. So, I set that one as, like, very yellow tone when it becomes nighttime because I just don't really want, like, a harsh LED light. So, last night, I didn't even get a chance to change it. I just fell asleep. I just briefly remember my mom walking in. And saying hi to Clem, I think. And then I just woke up at like 7 o'clock. So that's what's been going on. I, I rarely just fall asleep. It's very not like me. So. But got a full night's rest. I feel better. I have a little bit of footage of like random vlog footage. That I took like here and there. That I'll add at the end of the vlog. I'm going to show you guys what I do on a real day like spend the day with me but like this is so real like this could be even potentially boring for you because not all the time do I have something to do sometimes I'm just home and I have a lot to do at home or I don't have anything to do at home you know there it's just very different so welcome to spending the day with me like real raw spending the day with me <laughs> <laughs> We have like a random box of mangoes in our house. So I'm going to cut up some mangoes because we've been having berry smoothies because my mom bought like a frozen pack of like mixed berries. But I am more of a tropical fruit smoothie kind of person. I don't love berries too much. Like I'll eat strawberries and stuff. Not a big fan of just eating blueberries unless they're really hard. Trying to think of what else. Oh, I love raspberries, but I just don't like them in smoothies. I prefer eating berries fresh. Anyways, we have a box of mangoes, so I thought, why not? Because we also have strawberries, so I want to do a mango. We'll do like a mango strawberry green smoothie later. So I'm going to cut up the mangoes and put them in the freezer for now. Oh my god, they're so sweet. Hi, baby. We smell the mangoes. I know that there's a trick to get the mangoes out. I know, I know, I know. But I like cutting my mangoes. Cutting is so therapeutic. This is gambas al ajillo. I've been practicing that, you guys. I've been. I'm not even kidding you. I had to perfect it. It's originally a Spanish dish. My mom made it at camp, and I got really mad and jealous because nobody made it for me. So she's making me some. <laughs> oh my god, that looks good. You guys can't smell it. I know you can't, but I can, and it smells so good. So good. She added some pasta noodles so I can eat it like pasta. And my brother is joining me, of course. Oh, Man, I can eat it. I'll have that. These three could be yours. I mean, unless you want bread. Should we mix um, it? No, it must have to mix it as you go. <laughs> if you find any garlic, could you give me some? <laughs> Mm-hmm. Yeah. Pasta, Mom. Mom? Shrimp and the chicken. Oh, yeah. It's all yours. I don't like this guy. Stupid boy. Shrimp. Where did you hear my phone? Could you get Bong Jago Charmong? What the garlic? Bong Jago Charmong. Yeah. Uh huh. Are you a garlic? 
Okay. So I left the house. Totally didn't think I was leaving the house today. I remembered I had a few things to do. So then I thought if I'm going to go out and do a few things, I might as well stay out and go to the gym. I have not gone to the gym around this time. It's like 5 o'clock. By the time I end up at the gym, I think it'll be like 6 o'clock. I don't go to the gym during like this time because everyone is going to the gym at this time. Now, I don't know if that's still the case because obviously with COVID, a lot of people work from home, so then they do have time to go to the gym during their lunch breaks rather than, you know, at the end of work, which is why I think normally a lot of people go around at this time. Like right after work, they usually end up at the gym, right? Um, so we'll see how it goes. The last time I was at the gym at this time was when I first joined my gym and I wanted to see what it was like and I was like never again never ever 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 again and that was the last time so we'll see how it goes I'm honestly just trying to get on the cardio machines I went to Kohl's and returned my Amazon packages I think Amazon has one of the best like return you just hand it in they send it back they give you a return it's just so easy it's so easy um, you can also do it at like your UPS. I ended up at Kohl's, then I went to my P.O. box, and then I went to the gym. Didn't end up working out at the gym because I walked in and there was just too many people. I got really anxious, and so I just decided, you know what, no, like I'm not going to do that to myself. So I'm officially telling myself I am either a morning workout, like morning, like early, early afternoon, or like late, late morning. I usually go between the hours of like 10 and 2. I feel like it's really quiet. I can do all the things I need to do until I do weightlifting. And once I start incorporating weightlifting, I'm probably not going to be doing the, I'm not going to worry about that right now anyways, but I used to do it at night. I like weightlifting at night. One, less people. Two, I don't know why. That might change too, although I highly doubt it because there's a lot of people in the morning that weightlift and I don't like weightlifting with people because people stare and I'm a stare too and I know people can't help it so instead of making fe people feel like they can't stare at me I just won't put myself in that situation but I'm excited for the walk because Bala actually sent me some bangles thank you Bala so much um they sent me some bangles I wonder how heavy these are yoga pilates walking dance bar oh these are like the things you can use them as anyways that's so cute. I've looked into Bala before actually. They have some jump ropes I'm also interested in and I was looking at these bangles. They have really cool items and they're aesthetically pleasing. They're so cute. This is the blue one. They're so much smaller than I thought they were gonna be. I thought they were gonna be a lot like thicker in width but they're not. They're so cute. How heavy are these? Oh these are one pound each. And you may think like one pound, Michelle, that's not going to do anything, but it's pretty hefty. These are such good material and this is just so cute. Like the aesthetic of it, I cannot. They also have other colors if you haven't seen them, but I'm going to put these on and go for a little walk, a little walkie walk, a little hot girl walk. And I love that it comes with a pouch so they don't get lost or separated and you can protect them or even when you want to carry them to the gym or wherever you're going. Just got out of the shower. I feel so good relaxed I think I'm gonna sit and just enjoy the rest of the night actually in about an hour keeping up well it's not keeping up anymore the Kardashians are on and we're gonna see the whole Tristan thing go down gotta watch that um I think it's the season finale that's probably why they like waited to make that like the last big shebang but before I go I got a PR package that I'm really excited about from Cozy Earth they are a brand all about like luxury bedding pajamas, this robe. They reached out to me and said, do you want to share a discount code with your followers? And I said, absolutely, yes. And they sent me this robe. This is the kimono robe and it's so cute, so comfortable. It's kind of like the one from Target, but it feels so nice. You can tell the material and just the seam of it is just so good in quality and the fabric. I love the fabric. It's stretchy, 
so it definitely is not like tight and makes you feel weird i got an extra large so it's a little bit oversized but i really like it i think one of the things that i love about it though is that it's a quarter sleeve i'm assuming because it's a kimono vibe that's why it is but i actually like it because i tend to sleep in my robes like i love comfy dumpy robes and so when i fall asleep in it and wake up in it i tend to wash my face and brush my teeth and i don't like rolling up my sleeves usually so i like that they're quarter sleeves but you can just tell actually no you can't because it's black but just like the care that they take in all of the seams my mom is an amazing seamstress so it's just like when i see these things that my mom has like taught me over the years i'm like wow the quality is really nice. Something else that I also noticed about the robes that I actually really love that they tied this in is the back where the robe strings are is attached to the robe. So you won't lose the rope when you're washing it. Just in general, you know how like one side always falls? It like stays in place. And like for someone like me who's just like super like likes everything the same, it's always maybe that's the little things that make me happy i don't know cozy earth is actually oprah's favorite brand which is i think really freaking cool but i will leave the link down below as well as my discount code go get yourself a robe or pajama set they have really cute stuff everything will be in the descriptions i'm gonna end the night i'm actually gonna go downstairs because i'm a little hungry but i remembered i froze mangoes from earlier so i'm gonna make myself and my brother a smoothie and then call it a night. Thank you again for spending time with me. You guys know that I love you so much. Hey, look, I'm filming. Carlos, say hi. Hello. <laughs> you always get him when you're busy. When he's busy. Good. Lay down. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, that was like so close. <laughs> I was going to say, I was like, Mom, that looks really close. I just zoomed out a little bit. <laughs> Hi, Papa. So is she your girlfriend? <laughs> he looks like a little baby. He looks like a little Charlie. He's like, leave my brother alone. <laughs> oh my God, Mom, he looks like a little baby. Does he really? Oh my God. Okay, who's next? Casper would kill me if I tried to do this to him. Casper, do you want to be rolled up? I'm going to roll up Riley. channel we are actually on our way to Kim's this morning we are also in a different car we're in the Prius because save gas when you can Clummy's in the back she's getting groomed with Natalia who is Kim's groomer she comes every like four weeks to groom the four boys and it's like a big routine and I haven't had the opportunity to get a wash with her yet so today is the day Clem really needs a bath, but it is bright and freaking early. It is 8 in the morning. We woke up at 7.30. We both haven't done that in a very long time. I especially have not done that in a very long time. Three. Um, Israel. Um, wait. Oh, Honduras. Okay. South America. Um, Panama. Mexico. Korea. 
Nigeria. Um, Ethiopia. Wow. Canada. Arabia? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Um, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Dominican Republic. Russia. Oh my god. Brazil? Come on, Maiden. Let's go, Cassie Long Beach. <laughs> there, there's only five options. All right. Oh, dang. Carlos, I just I noticed. Only five. I just noticed some of the letters are not here. Yeah, I know. V is not here. Yeah, I know because I was about to be like Vietnam. Oh. <laughs> Let's go. Okay. All right. Oh my All right. god. Um, Finland. Oh, that's Finley. nice. Greece. Oh, yeah, that's all. Oh, sure. yeah. Um, that's good. <laughs> come on, I'm doing oh. it for me and you. Come on. There's only two. Holy shit. Damn. Um, Yo, can we have a minute? No. 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 No, come on. You stop. Come on. It's your turn. It's, no, no, <laughs> it's, your, turn. My turn. it's your turn. Oh, she. Oh, wait. Oh, my God. Can I have a call? <laughs> Who are you calling? <laughs> Twak? No. My husband? Uh, Can I have a call? No. Uh. Okay. O and W. What the hell? Go, Mom. Go. <laughs> go. Um. I think we both just forfeit because we're not gonna get it, and I'm not gonna get it. That's up to you guys. You guys gotta, I gotta search this up, man. <laughs> what is it? Do you guys it? know any? It, no, it's either that or you just pull all your letters up so you have more choices. You wait, can do wait, that? Wait, wait, wait. Okay, we'll oh. <laughs> you just keep going? Yeah, but, but you can't, we'll obviously you can't say the same countries that you've Oh, I don't, said. I won't even oh, remember no, we're them. No, we Okay, next time. What are the countries? Uh, remember, o and W. O and W. Omen? I would have never known. <laughs> w, what's W? I, w I was thinking Wakanda, but that's not real. You're so dumb. I'm done. <laughs> Wales. 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 Oh. Gosh. I am going to clean my room because over the week a lot of stuff have been just built in like everything is just like boxes everywhere I just need to clean my room um to start the week off yesterday my brother and I and Clementine went and hung out with Kim and Carlos we had a really good time we had game night which was really fun we were playing oh my god I don't remember the Oh my god, I don't remember the name of the game. Tabble? Wabble. Scabble. Scrabble. I don't remember, actually. Um, but it was a really fun game. Clementine got a groom. I'll show you guys. She looks so cute. So, so cute. It was our first time working with Natalia, who is, um, I believe, her Instagram down below. She does an amazing job. She's also a mobile groomer, so she can come to you. She shaved down... Clementine perfectly like she has the perfect cutest little summer cut body right now with cute little fluffy head She looks like a little ice cream scoop. Her head is just so round and cute. Oh while I was at Kim's house yesterday I actually I don't know what I did I think Clem got in my way around the feet while I was trying to walk so I completely like Landed on the side of my foot. So I literally thought it was broken I'm not even kidding you. I it's not swollen, but when I step on it, it definitely hurts. Maybe I sprained it. Maybe I pulled something. I don't know, but very grateful I didn't do anything more. The clutter in my room is giving me anxiety. My brother and I just did the spicy challenge. We're never doing it again. Why? I won. Cause I emptied out my bowl. You suffered a consequence, though. I will be the on the toilet. true consequence. <laughs> I will be on the toilet. At least I didn't die. Oh, yeah. Last time was horrible. Three? I feel like, in, in general, we still handle it really well. My whole stomach is literally burning. The things 
I do, I swear. Oh my god, I hate this feeling from the fire noodle challenge. But go watch it if you want good entertainment. If you guys care to know, I have now gone to the bathroom four times. I am not okay. Never doing a spice challenge again. Oh my god. Worst idea ever. <laughs> man. I look like an old man right now. Oh my god, you guys. I'm so tired. My body is exhausted from literally going to the bathroom all night. Clemmy. Clementine. I want to see if she'll come to the camera. Come here, baby. Come here. Come here. Come here. You look so shy. Come here. Come here. Come all the way. Hi. Say good morning. Your belly rubs. Thank you,